Adi Shankaracharya, this is the third quote. Sickness and its cure. Sickness is not cured by saying medicine, but by drinking it. This is my thousand and one day. <laughs> I thought I'll continue after the thousand day or not. But I thought if I stop, the gap, the communication gap is the greatest hurdle of any development, creating a gap. I thought, as long as the sun has not taken rest, you have no right to say that this is enough. It's not about the numbers. It's, let it be a way of life that you sleep and you get up in the morning, you continue to do your work. Adi Shankaracharya said, sickness is not cured by saying medicine but by drinking it. When Shankaracharya said by drinking it, people thought for sickness you have to drink medicine. No. He said when you become weak, Like the martial artist says, when they fall sick, they go and practice three times more than the normal time. They sweat it out and the sickness is gone. When you become weak, a foreign matter must have entered your body. When you become weak, you understood that cleanliness is next to godliness. So when you have to drink, it means... You have to drink your weakness. Means you have to use the same thorn to remove another thorn. Cleansing inside is very, very important. You go on a fast. You give the body rest and then the body is cleansed. When body is cleansed, that cleansing is medicinal meditative it is not a borrowed foreign matter let thy food be thy medicines Adi Shankaraj sickness is not cured by saying medicine but by drinking it like the husband and wife says I love you by saying I love you I love you you have not drunk get got drunk in that loving you were still with the love, I love you, but did you really go deeper and experience once you start drinking or loving your wife? Means you have absorbed your wife totally. And she becomes your body and she starts drinking you or loving you and you become her body too together is the strength of creating positive and negative yin and the yang which creates deeper light truth sickness is not cured by saying medicines but by drinking it when you see a question you kept on getting worried about the question Then you cannot get an answer for the question for all the students. You have to look into the question, be the question, melt with the question and answers, varieties of answers, varieties interpretations of answers flows. You do not have to worry. People get frightened when they see the questions. They study a lot. Study by heart. They fall sick. If you just love the question or the subject, answers flows of its own. Adi Shankaracharya says, sickness is not cured by saying medicine. Means your problem will, is not cured by saying family, my family. But by drinking it, you are drinking it means family sits together, eats together, prays together, grows together. You have to drink the family. The family is pure. Pure water, ozone water, you can drink the family and together it becomes strong. That is a time you never 
suspect. A suspicion comes from your borrowed knowledge and that is sickness. Try to understand. Borrowed knowledge is sickness. You always try to talk in that borrowed knowledge. In fact, you do not even have to say, I love you. They could feel your love when you smile. They could feel the love when the food is kept. You mix up the food properly and then put one tooth, a, a handful to your wife's mouth or to your children's mouth. And they in return mix it and put it into your mouth. You do not have to even tell, I love you. What a beautiful world. You do not have to stay in a separate room, maybe once in a while. Otherwise, you all sleep together in the same room. Then you do not have to say, I love you. Yes. When you take baths, you all take baths together, scrub together. Then you do not have to say, Adi Shankara sickness is not cured by saying medicine, but by drinking it means it's purely going deep into karma yogi. Sickness is not cured by saying medicines that I will do the work, I will do the work. All this is because of that problem, this problem. Karma yogis keep doing work without expecting results, like the Kaisan said. Every day one improvement, in 365 days you get 365 improvements. Simple. Every one drop makes a big ocean. That was what Adi Shankaracharya meant. Sickness is not cured by saying medicine, but by drinking it, by, by participating, by taking the spade and the pickaxe and going right into the field, cleaning up the drains in your cities, allowing the rainwater to flow beautifully. But the whole city is corrupted with negative thoughts, everybody pointing a finger to everybody. And that is what the rich richie wants it. Now there are no more rulers. Rich Richie are the rulers. <laughs> they also got drunk in their stupidity. Adi Shankaracharya sickness is not cured by saying medicine. Don't repeat like a parrot from the book. Read it for the sake of passing an examination because it's a mass hypnotism in this in this country around the world. But be an individual in that mass hypnotic. Learn what the slaves' languages. You can come back and make it always better. <laughs>